bitter Brussels bank halts billion pound UK investment projects despite us still paying. Bitter Eurocrats have halted the funding of vital billion pound investment projects in the UK despite Britain continuing to pay into the scheme, an investigation revealed. The European Investment Bank EIB, will reportedly put most UK applications for long-term loans on hold until a Brexit deal has been agreed the decision could impact big capital projects that fund schools, university buildings and hospitals due to the attractive interest rates in a statement the bank told The Times, in two years time the treaties will cease to apply to the UK and this means that it will cease to be a member of the EIB clearly the EIB group has to exercise a duty of care. Concerning operations maturing after 2019, and hence has to carry out careful due diligence in view of the current circumstances. The UK provides 16% of the capital of the Luxembourg-based multilateral institution, which exists to fund infrastructure spending and other activities that promote European cohesion and integration Earlier this year the EIB did agree to nine projects worth £1.4 billion in the UK but nothing has been financed since June Brexit does not necessarily mean the end of the UK's membership to the EIB although they require that members shall be the member states Piers Williamson, Chief executive of the Housing Finance Corporation, does not expect any funding in the near future. He said, the EIB has been a significant source of funding for UK housing regeneration for the last 20 years we understand that our existing contractual commitments will be met but we don't expect to be able to apply for any more funding at the moment. A university's UK spokesman said that the EIB decision would be difficult for the sector he said, if the European Investment Bank decided to no longer consider UK applications even before we leave the EU, it would be problematic for universities in recent years, funding has helped to build research facilities and modern teaching and learning spaces to ensure that UK universities facilities are internationally competitive. A Treasury spokesman said they were working on a workable alternative he said, we are clear that UK companies should be able to access EIB funding on equal terms as other member states while the UK remains a member of the EU while we work to make sure this happens. We have taken action to support business investment by authorising the British Business Bank to increase its support for venture capital funds and have offered construction guarantees on infrastructure projects. It follows reports that Brussels has already pulled the plug on the funding of technology firms in the UK before the vote to leave. The European Investment Fund provided more than half a billion pounds into the British industry but now technology firms say they are being refused the money they are applying for as Brexit talks plough on before the UK can eventually leave the Brussels club in March 2019 Rory Sterling, a partner in BGF Ventures, said, while they are not saying no officially, the clear message is that they are closed for business. They are doing eternal due diligence. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and don't forget to subscribe English News Hub for new excited videos.